Um, let me put this over here. I'm not going to be on real long, y'all. I'm probably going to be on just as long as it takes for me to put together um, this stuff because oh, my eyebrow itching. Because, um, my bad, y'all. Because I just dropped my son off and I really meant to stop at the store, but of course, I didn't change my clothes. So, um, I'm like, let me just go ahead and throw this in the oven and then I can run to the um, store and get a pack of chicken. But anyway, all right. Um, number one, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, hey, Nikki, baby. Thank you, babe. Thank you. Hi, Stacy. Um, number one, the juicy stuff. Thank you to my boo who commented on the video. I thought she was saying what well, I was popped or something or whatever on Camille's Corner. So I went over to go see like what the fuck I do. But, um, so Camille's Corner, hey, Brown Sugar, if you are not, um, yeah, I feel you, babe, I feel you, and you know what, right now might not even be the time to come back, but just, you know, stay in a cool head space and fuck them. No, I thought you were talking about me, I was about, I, that's why I said, what? <laughs> like, what I do? But anyway, but I appreciate you, because I went over to go watch, and hell yeah, hey, Tweety, um, yeah, Camille's Corner, you guys. Go check out Camille's Corner. She just is it's 2 and 0. Oh, Camille in favor of Camille's Corner. Thank you, boo. Thank you, Brown Sugar. Um, because she just exposed Leak you again for her raggedy ass. Um, y'all know that Lady Snoop showed that she was sent a, a cease and desist through email. And she showed y'all how uh, it was spelled wrong. It was a fake uh, cease and desist that leak you forged um, from an attorney's office. And it's a real attorney. Hey, Des. And Camille, she um, actually called the lawyer's office. My bad, y'all. I don't know what's going on. I don't know why I did that. But anyway, so um, happy uh, Monday, Des. Happy Monday, babe. So anyway, she actually called the lawyer's office. And yeah, they don't even deal with civil cases. They ain't sent out no cease and desist. They don't send them out via email. So yeah, it was just a whole fraud. Um, it's illegal what she did. So Leaky was really just really digging and building a case for herself here on YouTube is what she's doing. And um, it's so crazy because by the time she has charges against her, Pac Man, get over here, Pac Man. I'm going to beat your ass. I'm telling you right now, I'm going to beat your ass. Hurry up. It's cold outside. Hurry up. Get your ass in it. Won't your ass whoop. My bad job, but he had went all the way over to two houses over. Oh, get on my damn nerves. But anyway, yes, that was a good one. So anyway, yep, she called the actual lawyer's office. Leaky was just building a case for her damn self, okay? Because uh-uh, he he busts a hole through my fence. He runs his head into the fence until he knocks a wood loose. A piece of wood loose and then he squeezes through there and then if the house next door to me don't have a dog and that house used to be empty it was empty for over a year when I first moved in this house um the people had already moved out of there or whatever and now somebody finally lives in it but he just be over there like that's their yard you can't just go over there like that but then there's a dog on that side hey Fifi babe and he fucks with that dog or whatever he don't like the dog so anyway, <laughs> hey channel 85. But um yeah, and then I gotta go out there and scream and shit. And he um because I don't want him doing nothing to nobody else's dog and I get sued. That'll just be fucked up. Hey AJ, hey Sabrina. Um, child, they will get away. I got three dogs, my husband catch it. I'm trying to tell you, they will just go and then they'll come back looking all sad and he wanna ease his butt. Get your ass in here, it's cold. You want to ease up on the porch like he's scared to get hit or something. Oh, that is cray cray. How far are some people willing to go? I'm trying to tell you. 
I am trying to tell you, dog novels. <laughs> um, yeah, so she making fake cease and desist. Y'all know um, Camille's Corner is the same one who outed her about the fake death threats. And um, she said that video was still up over on Crystal Nicole's channel. It's not on her channel anymore. So if y'all do want to look for that video, it's look for Crystal Nicole. That's how you was with your rock. Aw. So, yeah, y'all. So, that's that would leak you. Let me get myself because I really do need to go to the store. So, um, anyway, I got to address Bama Girl vlogs, okay? I got to address her real quick because my thing is this. You know, I understand at some point people pick a side, okay? I understand that, you know... You know, she's Babe Nation and, you know, whatever, whatever. Okay? I understand all of that. What I'm not going to do is have people... See, here's the thing. I really... Hey, lovely. What the heck is going on now? It's a lot, babe. I promise you. It's, it's really... You know how they always say... You know, people are always... It's too much. It's getting to be too much. It's been too much. But at this point, it's just out of fucking control. Out of control. Um, I'm just going to make a little mini one. I ain't going to make a lot because ain't nobody here. But um, here's my thing. I, under, I don't care who people support or whatever. I never have. I never have. I'm a person that I can fall out. We can have a mutual person that I done fell out with, Right? And I will still come and support your channel, support you, whatever. I don't feel funny. I can be in the same chat. And that's what I was over on Jay Wilson's channel. When I was in there, Five A was in there. I don't care nothing about that. I move around people. I don't have to block a person. I don't have to do none of that. I just, you know, move around. I, I talk to who's talking to me. And I go, I comment uh, regarding the content creator's conversation. Hey, Miss Obey. That's what I do in a chat. Just because we have a mutual person I'm not cool with no more don't mean I'm just going to stop supporting you. You know? Um, but if you do, if people do feel like that and they do choose that, that's fine too. I'm okay with that. I'm good with that. It's a lot of content creators. I have, you know, shouted their channels out. I asked them, you know, share your channel in my chat and blah, blah, blah. But I have went and unsubscribed by now. Because, shit, you won't support me no more. What the fuck I'm still supporting you for? You know what I'm saying? It's cool. My thing is, hey, little miss, babe. My, no, no nations. No. You know, yeah, Suki. And that's, and that's the thing. You know, it's supposed to be a good time. This person gets off, you go over here. This person off, you go up here. You might be running a couple at the same time. You might be chat hopping. You know, nobody might not be on except for one. It, it's whatever, but it's a good time. You bump into the same people in different chats. Y'all having a good conversation, continuing a conversation from another one. It's a good time. Oh, babe, lovely. I, I understand, babe. I understand. It's too much. But... You know, my thing is, if you choose not to support me no more, it's cool. But you don't have to turn into a liar. You don't have to uh, continue on rumors that other people are repeating or starting. You don't have to try to sway the opinion of the people that I'm at fault for something when it's the complete opposite. You don't have to do all of that. In order to stay true to the person that you are loyal to. Supporting and loyal to. You don't have to do that. So I'm listening to Bama Girls Replay. And very beginning. Very beginning. Amazonian woman comes in. You hear her addressing her. Because I was driving while I was listening. You hear her addressing her. Saying, um, girl, why ask April coming for you? When did I come for her? And then the lady comments something about she asked me when was I when did I get a job or did I get a job yet? And then you laugh and then now hear the whole chat. Now it's all about ask April on the job. 
I don't even give a fuck about that because Bama girl, you another one. You commented about me getting a job and like it's the hardest thing in the world. When you was over here in my chat blowing kissy faces and all of that kind of stuff, did you ever say anything to me about a job then? I don't think you did. Cause see, this is what I'm not gonna do is be a fake ass bitch that's gonna just act like it. I see, I don't I don't just go along. I'm not no fake bitch. I don't give a fuck what you got, what you don't got, who you are. I don't care nothing about that. It's about your character. It's about who you are. Somebody asked something about reaching out to QB. Has anybody reached out to him? And you said, well, you know what? I just want to hold him and love on him. Well, you can't do that. So why wouldn't you just shoot an email or a text or something if y'all got communication like that? So because you can't put arms around him means that you just don't reach out at all, period. My thing is this. My thing is this. Anytime that my name is put in something and the shit is wrong, I'm going to come back and speak on it. Period. Point blank. You started your video out talking about Jay Wilson and how he's doing this, this, and that. And then when he come later on, when he's in your channel, because that part I did listen to earlier when I wanted to come back and talk about it. But when he was there sitting there and speaking, you were agreeing with everything that he was saying. But in the beginning of your video, you was talking about how he was wrong and, and, and you know, inconsiderate. I'm going to say this, you can support who you want to support, be loyal to who you want to be loyal to, but being loyal don't mean that you need to turn into a fake bitch. Not unless you was just already a fake bitch and, you know, it's just starting to show. If you saw her asking me about getting a job, then you saw that's when she came for me. Because you also saw then that I don't talk to none of them people, including you. Don't speak to none of y'all motherfuckers or whatever. I act like y'all not even there because I don't give a fuck because to me you don't even exist. I still watch some of your replays. I watched your replay when you shared a story about your past. And I was very much that, that story I felt like somebody needed that day. And I commented a nice comment. You commented back and that was all cool and good. And you can feel how you want to feel about me not working. But my thing is, every one of you hoes was over here in my chat, blowing kissy faces, ask April, and all of this stuff. And 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 five babe chat, as long as she over there smiling and, and whatever, and y'all smiling and happy too or whatever. And y'all nobody, not one of y'all hoes said anything to me about it being an issue that I'm not working. Now, one of y'all hoes said none of that shit. So, see, that's the type of bitch that I'm not. See, because if I have a person that I support and I feel like they are, they're not, uh, you know, operating to their full potential or they're not using the skills that they're given or they may, you know, be kind of stuck or whatever it is, you know, they, they're not, I don't feel like, I feel like they could be doing better. I would talk to them about that. I would mention that to them. But see, that's me. Hey, Lady Snoop, babe. Hey, Lady Libra, girl. Lady Snoop, did you see Camille Corner's video? So, that's my, that. I mean, I don't really have a whole lot to say to you because I didn't go through the video. You know what I'm saying? It, it's just the point that you, the content creator, spoke to someone in your chat. Hey, Deborah, babe. Love you too, boo, babe. Um... You, the content creator, it wasn't somebody called in. It wasn't somebody else started it. You started it and actually said that I came for somebody who I didn't come for. So I don't know. I mean, all I'm seeing is that, like they say, birds of a feather flock together. I guess it's true. Like they say, like-minded people. So, I mean, I guess because it's okay that y'all follow behind somebody. Hey, Antoinette, babe. Hey, Willie, babe. That y'all follow behind somebody that it's okay for her to lie or it's okay for her to do certain shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, well, I mean, yeah, Sambuka, they're, con they're concerned about me not working, but yeah, she's not working either. And that's exactly what my reply was. That's, when did I say I was paying you dust? 
When did I say I was paying you dust? When did I say I was paying you dust? See, you see how y'all repeat stuff and it's wrong? See, this is why I'm addressing you now. All I'm going to say is this. Don't put no fake shit out there about me. You can talk about whatever you want to that's real. That's true. That's fact. But if you so much of a real woman as you claim yourself to be, you're so much of a stand-up person, you so much about this and that and having integrity and shit, which I very much question because of you follow all types of shit and, and you, uh, you support all types of fuck shit. So I don't know how a person with integrity can can follow fuck shit but with you saying that i came for somebody when i didn't no i didn't i said when i'm in a chat i don't speak to you hoes is what i said i said when i'm in a chat i don't address you none of y'all that's what i said so no i didn't that's what i mean fact you said read your comment babe fact Stick with the facts and stop just making up shit. Yeah, they were already fake. Don't just make shit up on me. Y'all got me fucked up. Hey, CPR nurse. Like, I'm just so sick of y'all fake ass bitches on here. So, so bomb, Lashane. I'm sorry, y'all. If I got mad just because you confirmed something that she actually said, that's the epitome of a narcissist. Exactly. She said that shit. Hey, Red Rose. Gas smoker. How you doing, babe? I mean, and that's the whole thing. Like, wait a minute. Hold on, lovely. Hey, little miss. Little miss Nisi. Um, did I miss you? You said you was going back to the bushes. And yeah, they not going to ask her why she ain't working. Lovely, babe. I don't see it. Hey, B. Smith. Hey, Double D. She been caping for leak all day. What? Lovely, I don't see it, babe. It says that you're going back to the bushes. Um, Yeah, all I see is where it said you're going back to the bushes. Leak, you tried to log into your Instagram. Hey, Camille, Camille's Corner, your name is, is in my title. I'm sorry. I just saw your video, and I just applaud you because you 2-0, oh, hon. <laughs> you 2-0. <and> oh. <laughs> And I'm telling them to go watch your video. And I know you said it's on Crystal Nicole's channel now. But so many people, there's so many new people, Camille's Corner. Because I know you said in your video that um, a lot of people still don't believe it. And there's a lot of new people around too. And that are believing that she's, the, you know, this whatever, which she's nothing or whatever. But they believe in like this Bama girl that's in my chat. She's been over there. And they said she's been caping for her all day, you know. Hey, Pro Glam, my babe. So you got people like that that support people like her that spread lies. And, you know, they spread lies. They go for any type of manufactured anything that they put up on the screen. And they need to. She is the GOAT. She is. I've been watching Camille since when I first came on before I started really making videos. But um, don't accept anything from Lady Snoop TV show. I've been hacked. Oh, Lady Snoop's been hacked, y'all. I will post where it's from. Okay, Lady Snoop. Okay, babe. So Lady Snoop has been hacked and Leak You has tried to hack into Snow So Bomb's Instagram. So yeah, that's why your name is in there because we've been over here talking about her too, Camille's Corner. And I'm glad that you made that video and letting people know, just letting people know on a larger platform because it needs to be shown that how she forges things, she manufactures things, she's using her hey spicy red babe she is using her it and her employment um the things that she the tools that she has at her employment she's able to use those to do this dirty work that she's doing um she's doxing people looking up people's information tracking people's you know tracking their inter internet history and all that kind of stuff she's doing all of this kind of stuff i'm not really good at computers so i'm not using the proper verbiage but same with the death threats and that was my whole thing and that's why she don't like me because when camille made that video all that time ago and i said that she uh made them all made her own death threats and she was pissed off and that's so 
Girl, this ain't nothing new. This is not nothing new. You just mad when people repeat the fuck shit that you did. Like some other hoes on here. They just get mad when you repeat the shit that they said. The real shit that they did. Stop saying dumb shit and stop doing dumb shit and won't nobody have nothing to repeat. Like telling a grown ass man to suck your daughter's dick. But then you upset talking when he... Mm, mm. Just like when I was on Wiley's show yesterday and even one of the ladies on there said that they remember when she came on here and said that her daughter was molested. Leaky wasn't good with computers either considering how she always gets caught. And you know what that is? That is number one, like Camille says, she don't pay attention to detail. But not only that, you know, she's so anxious. She's so anxious to get it out and do something. This is too much. I feel like family is fighting and I'm in the middle. Oh, it's no problem, lovely. And I, and I understand, babe. And I, I understand. Have a good night, babe. But, you know, I mean, at the end of the day, I'm not letting nobody just lie on me. Flat out, period. I'm not letting nobody just lie on me or say anything about me. Don't be putting out no narratives that I'm coming for people in chats because that's what y'all do. Y'all do that. Y'all... Come for people in chats that you don't like. And it's not even your platform. I'm on somebody else's platform supporting them. And y'all want to start piling up. And then the person that they following behind and they caping for, she don't even get it in check. She she join in. That's, that's dumb shit. But So you see why they do what they do. It's just like a, a fucked up ass mama and they kid out here just ratchet as fuck. It's, it's, I mean, what do you expect? What do you expect? You know what I'm saying? So I don't expect much, but I do move around you hoes. Like I said, when I'm in a chat, I move around you hoes and don't even say shit to y'all. Don't just put no words in my motherfucking mouth. Don't paraphrase. Don't do none of that shit. Say what the fuck I said. Shit is irritating as fuck. And you try to be halfway decent with people and just let them be who they are and let them do what they do. And then they want to keep on putting your name. And then y'all want to say, I'm pressed, though. I'm the one that's pressed. But my name comes up in every fucking live. Like, every live that any of y'all people do, I hear I come. Like, what? I'm watching this for something else. Fi is on video saying that disgusting stuff about her own daughter. Yeah, she said that about her own daughter. I didn't even get a message. She tried to log into my account and Instagram said no. Instagram said no, leak you, leaky puss, bitch. <laughs> Double D, say it again. I move around, you hoes. I mean, it's just period. Like, I don't got to look. No. Yes, is she still friends with Christy? That's what I don't know because... um. They were saying that they nobody can find Christy because they were saying that Christy knows a lot of the real stuff, a lot of the truth. And so people were looking for her not too long ago. But, yeah, yeah, you were a topic in that chat last night. But why if they don't like I mean, every freaking live somebody say something about me and then y'all say I'm pressed. And I don't even care what you say. Just let it be true. It's a whole lot you could say. Like, just say that. You know what I'm saying? I say, yep, come see me. These games aren't fun, nor funny. Enough is enough. Enough is enough. Period. It ain't funny. This shit, it, it ain't funny at all, y'all. It's not funny. It's not... It's not even interesting. You liked Christy? See, I wasn't too familiar with her. I watched a couple of her videos, but... Yeah, I wasn't too familiar with her. She was over there with, um, I seen that she was over there with that DJ Ash girl. And I was like, mm -mm. Mm -mm. uh-uh, be quiet. Apparently you are, you are valuable. Mm. Hey, Nay love. I see you moved around these hoes. <laughs> I did. She was just as messy as Lee. That's what I thought be stuff, especially when I seen she was over there modding for that Ash D. I said, oh, no. Uh-uh, girl. Uh-uh. But Pac-Man, be quiet. Uh-oh, my bad, y'all. But anyway. 
anyway, shout out to Camille's Corner, and I appreciate her so much for stopping by. That was so nice of her. And, um, oh, there goes, she go right there. So she said, oh, and we are not friends. So, um, yeah. Why did you and Leak you part ways and did you have to sign anything? Oh, did she have to sign anything? Okay, I say, well, you have been very humble. <laughs> well, I appreciate you. That is so amazing that you know this. <laughs> Y'all so silly. Y'all so silly. Oh, my God. But, um, like you said, Christy was her best friend. Oh, wow. See? And that's what I don't see. I don't know because, see, I didn't watch. Mm -mm. I didn't know what was going on with that whole situation or, um... You know their dealings and all of that kind of stuff. I'm not. I'm not privy to that. I don't understand why people don't understand that karma will knock one day when they do the crazy stuff like doxing, making up emails, and being plain malicious. I don't know why either. You know why people get people get get away with something once, and they damn sure gonna try it again. You know. Okay, lovely babe. Thank you for still being here. April, I asked because her former mods are quiet when they were committing acts with her. I'm glad y'all found the light, though. Oh, shit. Mmm. Mmm. Wait, Christy, now you and Leek not friends, girl. You swip. Oop! <laughs> you giving me whiplash. Oh, my God. You don't even know her. Why you caping for another woman so hard and doing high school mean girl shit? Man, tell her again, Miss O. And I, I mean, I, I had a little, you know, uh, I liked Bama girls. I mean, I, I liked her. I thought, I thought she was cool. I thought she was level headed. See, it's just. You just got to sit back and watch people. That's all, y'all. That's all I'm going to say. Sit back and watch people. Don't just attach yourself to personalities and stuff that you first see and all of that stuff. Sit back, watch, you know, engage and all that kind of stuff. But don't just jump in like that, you know, because you end up seeing shit along the way. Leak, you have user and abuser. Ooh. Ooh. I've been getting my whole life today in these YouTube streets. <laughs> Is a sweetie. That's what made me come out the bushes. Love me some. Yeah, Camille, I just her accent. And she just, I'm gonna tell you something. Since I have been on, since before I've been on here, I watched her. And when you say haven't changed, when you say consistent and all of like she, that's her. She's consistent, she's talented, you know, she got a good head on her shoulders. But that's what I mean. You sit back, you watch people, you know. I mean, yeah, about my girl, she. She just another sheep strolling in my neck brace. <laughs> oh my god, super chat. You play too much. So crazy. Just that far I was over there with Ash because I thought she was innocent when that horrible stuff with the tape happened. She wasn't innocent. Yeah, no, she wasn't innocent. She wasn't innocent. And you know, I'm gonna say this about me because I do say things. I will give my opinion about people um about things that i see but i don't have receipts and proof of it and that's where i don't dig in too deep and stuff i just mention what i see and i kind of just you know i i can i'm pr a pretty good judge of character pretty good don't get it all the time you know as y'all can see but i just had that for her she was just one of those people that i just knew wasn't shit and but i had no way to really prove it you know so i mean i can't blame nobody for you know you know giving somebody a chance because i don't have no way to prove what i'm feeling or what i'm seeing you know um because it's not fact it's just a feeling so you know i don't everybody gotta see for stuff for themselves. but yeah yeah she damn sure wasn't innocent uh about none of the shit that she involved in at all Glamour and Christy, can you at least admit she lied on CNI and Red Rose? 
Oh yeah. See, I don't know. I didn't know about CNI being included, but I damn sure know they lied. She lied on Red Rose. Yep. Yeah, yeah, Brown Sugar. You gotta sit back and watch. They were good friends until June, July. I was a blind follower, and not proud of it. It's all good. It's all good. You know, you can only see what you can see. You know, and not just keep on going with it when you do see it you know like a lot of these people on here they just keep on rolling keep on rolling with it you know until they get caught out and they get out and they're gonna have a whole lot to say then hey my better have a whole lot of shit to say after you get kicked out but until then y'all just gonna roll with it I dozed up earlier and then I had to pick up my RJ. No, it's all good, babe. It's all good. I really didn't mean to come on to stay too long because I got to run out. But um, I was, I really wanted to address um, Bama Girl because I don't appreciate her claiming that I'm coming for people in the chat when I'm not doing so. It's the complete opposite. And then she want to laugh and shit when they tell her and not clear the shit up. I can't respect that. Um, and... You know, just because you don't like a bitch don't mean that you just, you know, you just put shit out there on them just for no reason. You know what I'm saying? Just to get your get your your chat to go in or whatever. You know what I'm saying? That shit ain't cool. That's where your integrity goes down the drain. That is where you cannot be trusted. You know, that's just where you show people that you just really ain't shit for real. And you ain't no different than a lot of the other people on here. That's what that shows. You know, when you just say anything and do anything just because you don't like a person you know like we talking about leak you she just don't like people or she just wants some attention or you know she just got something in her that she just wants to you know control the situation and all that shit that just shows that you want an alien shit ass person something is wrong with your character and you need to work on that because people is too old we too old to be on here being fucked up as people and then y'all want to talk yourself up like you just so much of this this and that and this amazing person and you got this amazing life and you just so together yet y'all just follow the fuck shit like it's just the thing to do but um yeah So, if I can't just learn and enjoy what I enjoy, good night, y'all. Yeah. I mean, lovely, all I'm going to say is, you know, in my chat, a lot of times people want me. I'm supposed to be the one to just let it go. I'm supposed to be the one to not respond. I'm just supposed to just be over here, be quiet, just let these people just keep bringing me up in a negative light, lying on me. And all that stuff, like, I'm supposed to be that person. But then when these people are live and they're talking about me and they're and all of this stuff where I go to somebody's channel and then, you know, this, and it's this one person. It's one common denominator that is causing these problems. That's who caused the issue on the gentleman's panel. The first time Official King Payne had the gentleman's panel on his channel and you got this bitch's people over there going in on somebody. This ain't your channel. He can be here. Like, he can be here. Why are y'all concerned with him being over here just because you don't get along? Same thing with Jay Wilson's chat. It's his chat. I'm not on her channel. I went to her channel and said I'm here to get blocked. I don't know if I got blocked or not. But I did. I went there to get my blocking. Since that's what she put out there when they see me in there to block me. So I went over there to get blocked. Nobody addressed me then. I go in your chat and people don't address me. But when you see me everywhere else, you want to address me. And then people will come over on my channel who are like supposed to be neutral. And they want me to, can we just do this? Can we just do that? Can I just, what well, do we tell that? Do we say that to this person? Or is she getting the same comments? I bet not because what she says is don't come over there with that fuck shit or you will get blocked. Don't tell her what to say or, or who to address and all that shit. That's what she say. But because I don't say that and I don't treat my people like that, then I'm supposed to just be the easier one to approach and say, oh, can you know, maybe we should just let it go or this is just, mm -mm. Mm -mm. hey, just, just. 
Girl, a lot of fuck shit. I want to put up more makeup videos, but the YouTube streets are by. Kimmy, still do it, babe. Still do it because it will be a... It'll be something outside of the fuck shit. It'll give somebody something else, you know, something else that's not not ugly. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Monica. Hey, Monique. Hey, Jess. It's just the same shit, girl. Same shit. She's on the side of sanity and truth. Killer, how can you now swing for her? I should be your new mind the way I'm swinging for <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean how can she swing for her they quick to say all are welcome but quick to block somebody i came with this man and just went in on me i backed up that's crazy lovely that's crazy i'm sorry that happened to you babe you know because you should be able to ask questions but it's just difficult in my opinion, when I, you know, and I mean, this is not a topic. Like, who the fuck wants to talk about this shit every day? You feel me? Like, this, it's not, I want to talk about other people's drama. I don't want to talk about my shit. You know what I'm saying? Because it, it ain't no different. It's just the same shit. So, I want to come on here and talk about. What Club Shing Shang got going on, or this hoe over here, or that bitch over there, or whatever. You know, talk that shit. I want to talk about, you know, real life stuff and different things that are coming up and happening around. I just want to talk about all types of stuff. It don't every day got to be, hey, Cookie. You know what I'm saying? Got to be what they said about Ask Caper. And it's the same shit. Like, y'all ain't even say nothing different. Same shit. But that's how I know I'm about to get a job because people keep talking about it. Because it always gets worse before it gets better. I'm going to tell you that. Trust and believe that. So anybody got some shit going on, trust and believe. It will get, it, it gets worse, but then it's going to get better. And watch. Watch what I tell you. So it's all good. It's all good. Who got you blocked, babe? Um. Hey, Melissa. Oh, thank you. Thank you, babe. Absolutely, Libra. And I appreciate you saying that, babe. It's it's gonna be all good. I'm telling you something. And when that takeoff takes off, it's it's gonna be a great thing. Y'all just watch. Y'all just watch. It's you know, it's good. And it's just, you know, you talk about it and you just want it to just happen. You know what I'm saying? But I ain't going to lie. I'm kind of scared for it to happen. I ain't going to lie. <laughs> like, and I've, I've said that recently. Like, I don't know. Like, I am a Capricorn. I'm not so much like change. Like, I just like shit to be okay. You know what I'm saying? So, but it's all good. It's going to work out how it's going to work out. That's what I know. That's what I know. Um, oh. oh, shit. My bad job. So, yeah. But, yeah. So, y'all check out Camille's Corner video. She just uploaded it. Um, she is showing you. Y'all know Lady Snoop came on. She shared her email. Showed y'all how the thing was a fake. Um, Camille's Corner went just a little step further and actually called the law office that she said that cease and desist was from. She got some information. Hey, Crystal Bay. And um, y'all can listen to it. She, you will actually be able to listen to it, showing you that that law firm don't even deal with what she trying to the situation she's lying saying lady snoop is she has with her so just um definitely go check out her video y'all and go to crystal nicole 
CNI Pursuits. I think it's still CNI Pursuits. Either you can, but if you uh, type in Crystal Nicole, I think it'll come up anyway. But either CNI Pursuits or Crystal Nicole, and go to her video, go to her channel, and look for Camille Corners video the first one that she did showing that leak you sent herself those death threats because there's so many new people and like like camille said a lot of people still right now don't believe that she sent herself them death threats that bitch crazy to sum it up nuts like who the fuck does that she flagging that's a shame. Like, I don't know what the fuck for, bitch. Like, you are a whole nut. Like, do does anybody know about Leak You personally? Does anybody know if she has some type of mental issues or something like that? Yeah, she did. Got her all the way together. Hey, Lady T. Sorry to just jump off the porch, Bo. Who her Diamond Dory said I... What? You stole from her. That funky bitch. Mm. Camille Corner is a whole trained working journalist in real. Oh, does she do it in real life? I didn't know that, Kay. I know that. If you need someone to send you some more leaky <laughs> for sale, no police. Hold up. She said you. that, And that's another crazy ass nut. Dory and leaky puss. Them two hoes right there. I'm going to tell you something. Those are two nothing as nothing that you need the channel and video. If y'all, y'all, um, anybody seen that Dory, uh, said that Lady T, did anybody know about that? Anybody seen that? Cause I know on her channel, she talking about, uh, she got a defamation of character, uh, defamation suit against me. Talking about she going to uh, let it go as long as I don't talk about her. Bitch, file that bitch. Please file it. Well, that tells it right there why um Camille's Corner be on her shit like that. That tells it right there. Because she sure be on her shit. She know exactly what the fuck she be doing. She, I know she called that damn lawyer's office. And they said, no, ma'am. What was that man's name? Robert Gregg? Robert Gregg said no. Hell to no, 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 no. Where is... Hold on. I, I don't have enough open. Hell to no, no. These ain't open either. I think I got some fried onions that's already open. I know I have some. I thought I had some that was already open. But I guess not. I was trying to say B. Smith, right? Me too. Oh, I need a real lawyer. I'm beyond pissed. Girl, Lady T, you didn't ask. How are you going to steal something from somebody that you ain't never met? Don't let her do that to you. I mean, you can get a consultation, but I'm going to tell you right now, don't nobody believe that shit. And you know what? You probably just need to, you you need to get some type of um, online restraining order. Oh, I need a glass of wine. You sharing? <laughs> that receptionist said, it's Robert Gregg with two G's, bitch. <laughs> Y'all so silly. Three cards got. I'm just going to do a half a cup. A third of a cup. A half a cup. So...
B. Smith, fake you as a scammer. What? I already have a police report. She needs to learn a lesson. I'm not let. Don't let it go, then. Don't let it go. You go with how you feel, babe, because only you know. Only you know. So, whatever you feel is best, you do it. That shit crazy as fuck. Like, this bitch really just real life goes on this damn YouTube and just spread shit around about people like she a whole fucking nut. I mean, she just a troll. That she just be in the chats, just trolling, just making the whole conversation. People don't even be talking about the shit she talking about. And then she just want to make it about them, just like she lied on me. She was over there lying on me, talking about I asked her for help and this, this, and that. Bitch, you got me fucked up. Like I'm so sick of y'all bitches on here acting like somebody asking y'all for something. And they don't even know you. I don't even know you, bitch. I wouldn't even have knew you existed or none of that shit. You know, if you got a damn uh, QB or 5 or anybody else fool that think that you a real life attorney or you can do something for them, bitch, pay them. Because that's all it is, is that you on here paying motherfuckers. And for what? Diving for depth, you funky, ugly, ugly, funny looking ass bitch. Keep my motherfucking name out your mouth. I'm so sick of y'all hoes. In my Tracy's voice, I'm sick of you hoes. I mean, y'all bitches just say any motherfucking thing. Like, that shit is irritating. Too old. I, and I'm, no, a lot of these bitches be too old, though. Like, 60s. Like, bitch, where is your grandkids? You ain't got no old wrinkle balls to put in your mouth or something. Do something, bitch. Fumble them things in your damn hands or something, bitch. You should be fumbling some old wrinkly balls or something in the middle of your fingers or something. Bitch, you're sitting in your rocking chair. You know what I'm saying? Fumbling your husband old ass balls. That's what the fuck you should be doing and being on YouTube starting fuck shit. Okay. Diamond Dory, you want to talk all that shit. You got all this motherfucking money. You got all this. What you say? You got a husband. He lets you have your house looking like that. Y'all want to say my house is dirty and all this shit. Your husband, don't you got a maid? You got money, right? Y'all be getting on my motherfucking nerves. Y'all be on here. You make a whole life for yourself. Y'all will be on here creating a whole motherfucking life for yourself that don't fucking exist. It's not real. It's not real. Okay, like y'all need to fucking just grasp reality and deal with that shit for what it is. And if you want your life to be that shit that you talk about, then work towards that. But don't just be on here making shit up. And then you want somebody you just want and anybody who don't believe your shit is the way that you try to make it. They just the dumb people, right? Like they the fucked up ones because they not just going to let you just, you know, just blow smoke up their motherfucking ass. So now... You know what I'm saying? That That's the enemy. Bitch, fuck you. Period. I've never seen your house dirty, even with the clean clothes in the bathroom. <laughs> Thank you, babe. <laughs> Thank you, babe. But, yeah, I don't, yeah, mm -mm. fuck my own no dirty ass house. Like, they just got me fucked up. And I'm in here all motherfucking day, every day. What the fuck? I mean, at least I could clean my motherfucking house, bitch. You ain't working, bitch. You better be cleaning the motherfucking house. The fuck? What sense do that make? I'm the sexiest crackhead on the planet. Yes, you are. <laughs> I need to be there with you to tap your shoulder in between me getting up off the floor. Oh, my God, Fedora, you so crazy. <laughs> sure wish I could fumble some balls. I definitely wouldn't be on YouTube. <laughs> For sure. I pro oh, my God. Like... But these people, they say they got... Oh, oh, my goodness. Their careers, they're just so wonderful. Like... April, they mad. You're natural and beautiful and just kicking it. They have to act and make up personalities to entertain. That is so crazy. Exactly. More drama on YouTube than real life. They just, oh, my life. Oh, it's so, oh, I have so much money. I just, so much money. I'm just so, oh, my husband, my, my husband, you know, and we just do this. And I have so much business to take care of. I got stuff to do. Like, I have business. You know, I have stuff that I have to do, you know. And But you on YouTube, bitch, you sleep YouTube. You sleep YouTube. Like, 
Where where do your business and your money and your husband and your great life fit in there? And she said I was insensitive. Oh my God. <laughs> insensitive girl. She is a whole weirdo. Like, oh, she just looked like she looked totally spaced out. Like it is something behind her eyes that's just it's just empty. Like it ain't like I promise you you knock on her motherfucking head and it's just hollow. I promise you. I promise you just like holler in her ear like hello in there and it just start echoing hello 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 <laughs> when that weird my weirdo commented she lived by the beach the other day I almost came through this damn screen. <laughs> Oh my God. She's talking about $40,000. The fuck? Bitch, show you got $40,000 for somebody to steal. These motherfuckers is crazy. Oh my God. I promise I would. Oh, I promise. I promise. I would, I would probably bet my existence on that. She don't even got 40 grand for you to steal. I probably would do that because I just believe she that retarded. Yeah, I think she is. The fuck? Diving probably who called QB about why. Yep, and you know what? I said it was Dory, but it probably was di diving. It was one of them hoes. It was one of them weird ass bitches. It's exactly was one of them weird ass bitches. So, yeah, so. These hoes is just fucked up, man. I promise you. Like, they just fucked up. But, okay, yeah, y'all. So, let me get on up out of here so I can make sure I got to run to the store and come back so I can cook before um it's time before I go get my son back from driving school. So, I will see y'all later. I got to go throw something on real quick. And I'll put the green bean casserole in the oven. I love y'all. Y'all so cool. Let me see. I meant to tell her that. She right. Or I can go, because if y'all still talking, hold on. I'm going to go throw something on y'all. I'll be back.
Okay, y'all. So y'all going, is Lady Snoop going live? Whew. Love you, brown sugar, babe. Thank you, lovely. Because we are Ohio Wednesday, our Chicago Wednesday. It's all good, babe. It's all good. Don't, it, you know, it's you all good, babe. You like who you like, and it is what it is, you know. Oh, did you? My phone is down here. My bad. I was upstairs throwing on some clothes. Okay, y'all. So, Lady Snoop is going live. I'm going to go to the grocery store. We'll see Lady Snoop in her chat. I don't know if I'll be back on tonight, but if I'm not, I love y'all. Have an amazing night. And um, I'll see y'all in the streets. And um, that don't sound really uh, ladylike, do it? I'll see you in the streets. <laughs> love you too, Kimmy, babe. Love y'all, Crystal, Veronica, Double D. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you to Camille's Corner. Uh, hey, Miss T Velocity, how you doing, babe? I enjoyed your video. I don't know if you saw my comment, James, chat, but I do enjoy your video, hun. And I, it's, it's just too bad to fall on deaf ears. Bye, AJ. Thank you. Thank y'all all for being here. B. Smith, thank you so much, babe. Um, Yeah, I'll be safe. Bye, Antoinette. I love y'all. All right. Um, what was that little Rambo? Crystal, my Miss O, my Willie. Thank you, y'all. I just want to make sure I didn't miss anybody. Gemini, if you up there. No nonsense if you up there. Miss Tony, I love y'all. Um, kiddo, I don't know if she lurking. But, Christy, thank you for stopping by. I appreciate that. My proud glamma. Red Rose, we got you, babe. Stacy. So, yeah, so... um. Fedora, thank you so much, babe. Yeah, I appreciate everybody, all the other content creators who stopped by tonight. You know, check out everybody's channel. Um, no, they don't know Ohio. They don't. Okay, bro, and I absolutely am. I'm going to check my email while I'm out, and I'll be doing that. So you'll hear from me tonight, okay? All right, I love y'all. I'll see y'all later. Okay, Lisa, babe. Bye, X-Killer.